Okay, this is our story about the robot inventor, Toma Takahashi. Tak 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 oh, man. I always mess up his name. Toma Taka Takahashi. Now, this genre is a biography. We haven't had a biography before. Biography means that it is about a person. Okay, so anytime we have a biography, it's going to be about a person. So that's our genre for this story. Big Ideas. Meet Tomotaki Takahashi. He invents unusual robots. How did he get started? Mr. Takahashi was born in Japan in 1975. As a child, he played with blocks. He used his imagination to make all sorts of forms and shapes. So that's what he was doing when he was a kid. And here's Japan. Later, he read comic books about a robot named Astro Boy. The robot looked like a real child. Takahashi wanted to make robots just like it. Finding out about robots. In 1999, Takahashi began to study robots. He took classes to learn how they move. The robots bent their legs when they walked. It did not look right to Takahashi. People did not walk that way. Then Takahashi had an idea. He made a better robot. It did not bend its legs when it walked. It moved more like a person. Kind of looks like a person too. He's got eyes and arms and legs and a body. And look at his feet. Making better robots. In 2003, Takahashi started his own company. He made many robots. A short robot climbed up a cliff with a rope. A bigger robot lifted a car with its arms. Another robot rode a bike for 24 hours. That's a whole day. I don't think I could ride a bike for a whole day. Takahashi began to put his robots in contests. He made three robots for a sports race in Hawaii in 2011. The first robot had to swim. The second robot had to ride a bike. The third robot had to run. The robots had to do these tasks for a week. I think in the Olympics they call that the triathlon because you have to swim and ride a bike and, and run. For the race, there were many problems to solve. Takahashi made the swimming robot waterproof. He gave it arms like fins to help it swim faster. Another robot was able to ride its bike for 100 miles without braking. The third robot ran for 26 miles. What will Takahashi invent next? Will his robots fly and soar like Astro Boy? Will they be his finest? Mm, we can only guess. We must wait and see. Tomataka Takahashi is sure of one thing. His robots will do more and more. I'll bet if your mom or study buddy would look it up, you might find out more information about 
Takahashi and what he's doing now.